Good morning, Dragons. My name is Lonnie Allen, and I'm the Director of Athletics here at Tiffany University. And I want to welcome you back for another great year of Dragon Athletics. Today, we're going to talk about orientation and what it's going to take to be a Dragon and to get you through the year. But before we're going to do this, we're going to show you a video of everything else, and we're going to introduce you to the sixth president of Tiffany University, Dr. Lillian Schumacher. Welcome Tiffin University student athletes. We're so happy to have you at Tiffin University. You know, being a student athlete comes with a lot of responsibility. You are a student first and an athlete second. And I know how important it is for you to be an athlete at Tiffin University. We know that you're gonna compete strong. We also need you to do the best you possibly can in the classroom and be good role models for all of our students and for your peers on and off the field and on and off the court. So you're a role model for us. We're so proud to have you as a student athlete. Do the best that you can. Do well in the classroom, compete well, and we are so proud to watch you. My husband Ron and I look forward to seeing you compete in the season. The best of luck and go Dragons. Hi, I'm Dr. Pete Holbrook, Provost at Tiffin University. I'd like to welcome all our student athletes back to campus and thank you so much for being a part of our rich tradition of athletics at TU. We are here to support you every single day, whether it's in the classroom or on the court or on the field. You are an important part of our history and our um, daily activity and life on campus. Um, athletics is very important to us and we are here to make sure that you succeed not only as a student athlete but also as a student at Tiffin University. So I wish you well in your endeavors, continue to make us proud and welcome to the Dragon family. Hi, welcome to campus. My name is Krista Swanigan. I'm a financial aid counselor and academic services coordinator here at TU. Today I want to talk about eligibility and how you can maintain it while you're at Tiffin. Uh, in order to maintain eligibility you need to be a full-time student and that's 12 or more credit hours. Uh, if you're in your final semester before graduation, then you just need to take the number of credit hours needed to graduate. You must pass nine hours each semester, and you must pass 24 hours in an academic year. If you not, do not pass nine hours in a semester, you will not be eligible the following semester. You must also have a 2.0 grade point average at the end of every academic year, and you must also have a declared major by the, your junior year. If you have any questions at all, please contact me. I'm located in the Financial Aid Office in Sites Hall, and my email address is swanagank at tiffin.edu. My phone number is 419-448-3281. Let's go Dragons! Hi, I'm Kevin Cashin, and I'm the Faculty Athletic Rep to the NCAA for Tiffin University. Welcome to Tiffin University, and I look forward to working with you. If you have any needs regarding academics and athletics, please contact me. My email address is cashink at tiffin.edu. My office number is 419-448-3322. Each team will have a faculty sponsor. Those will be announced later in the year. And those faculty sponsors can help you as well if there's any problems between the academics and the athletics. Thank you and have a great year. Tiffin University is committed to providing an educational experience and environment that is equally accessible for all, including those with a documented disability. The Office for Disability Services provides educational opportunities for qualified individuals with disabilities through accessible programs and services. It is the student's obligation to request a reasonable accommodation provide appropriate documentation from their licensed medical care provider to support that request, and to actively engage in the process of determining the best accommodations. To register with the Office for Disability Services, just go to the Disability Services page on Tiffin University's website or to the new MyTU portal and fill out the registration form and submit it online. We will contact you after we receive your registration. The Office for Disability Services is a division of the Office for Equity, Access, and Opportunity and is located in Freedley Hall. Please feel free to contact us at 419-448-3021 or email us at disabilityservices at tiffin.edu. 
Hello, Tiffany University student athletes. My name is Julie Richards, and I'm the Director of Counseling and Wellness at Tiffany University. My office is located in the Seneca House, which is the small little brick and white house with the wheelchair accessible ramp right out front. You can access our services by emailing us at counseling at tiffin.edu, or you can contact our front office at 419-448-3429. We like to do lots of different services on campus. We work with groups and individuals. You might see us out and about doing wellness presentations. We also work with individual athletic teams, um, providing information on topics such as alcohol awareness and its effect on your training and performance, anxiety and stress management, body image, and goal setting. So our counselors are available to you Monday through Friday by appointment. We have hours available in the evenings as well so you can come to see us when your practice is over and after you've had dinner in the calf. Um, once again if you want to reach us to schedule an individual appointment or to talk to us about coming to meet with your team you can contact us at counseling at tiffin.edu or you can contact the front office at 419-448-3429. Again we're so excited that you're here on campus and we look forward to helping you achieve your success on and off the field. Thanks, and it's a great day to be a Dragon. Welcome. My name is Lucas Phillips, and I'm the head athletic trainer here at Tiffin University. My sports medicine staff and I are excited about another year of Dragon Athletics. I want to go over a couple things that you will find in the athletic training room rules that are located in your student athlete handbook. First, I ask that you please be on time for all appointments, rehabs, treatment sessions, anything that we have scheduled for you. We put a lot of time and effort into take care of, taking care of you guys and we ask that you respect our time as we will respect yours. The next is the most important rule for everyone. If you sustain an injury or an illness while participating in athletics here at Tiffin University, you must see your athletic trainer first before seeking out other medical attention, unless it is an emergency. If you do so and go see a doctor on your own or go home and see a doctor, you will be responsible for any and all bills that are incurred for those visits. That may be the doctor's visit, x-rays, MRIs, surgeries, or rehabilitation. So those bills can add up in a hurry. So please follow our rules, see our athletic training staff first, and we will refer you to the proper doctors. Lastly, I just wanna make sure that you take the time to read through all of the training room rules. There's a lot of them here, I'm not gonna read them all for you, but if you choose not to follow these rules, we will ask you to leave the athletic training room without receiving treatment. Thank you, and let's have a great year. Hi, I'm Nene Wagner, and I'm the president of SAC, the Student Athletic Advisory Committee. SAC is incorporated in a lot of stuff throughout the community and the school. Every team consists of two representatives. There are various ways that SAC gives back to the community, and one of the biggest ways that we give back is Make-A-Wish. We do various fundraisers throughout the year. Not only is your voice heard on campus, it's also heard at the national level. If you have any questions, seek out your SAC rep, and have a great year, and go Dragons!